people, we are back with another Chef C special. Yes, what we have in front of us today, or what we're gonna be making, is a homemade peanut punch. Yes, here in Tanzania, Dar es Salaam, we're making peanut punch. But the first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna make almond milk as our base liquid, okay? We're gonna make the almond milk first, and then we're gonna, we're gonna introduce all these nice flavors, like oatmeal, banana, these are alkaline bananas. If your banana is bigger than this, it is not alkaline, okay? These are alkaline bananas, some peanut butter, we got some sugar, right? some brown sugar, because that's the melanin, all right, say less. We got cloves and cinnamon, and we got vanilla extract, and we got nutmeg, and of course, we have some almonds, some fresh almonds, from the store. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna make our almond milk and we're gonna make our peanut punch. We're gonna come back and then you're gonna taste the, the flavors are gonna pop in your mouth. Oh my goodness. This, this is amazing. So stay tuned and come on back. We're gonna put this together. See you later. Okay, people, we are back. And like I said before, we are making peanut punch, but we're making almond milk as our base liquid for the peanut punch. Yes, people, you heard me. Almond milk as is a base liquid for my peanut punch. Okay, so what we have here, we got two cups of, of almonds. We got your nutmeg, your cinnamon, and your cloves, and your sugar. Okay, people? And we have, now, now the recipe calls for one cup of almonds to three cups of water. So I got two cups of almonds, and I have five cups of water. I, I don't want the extra cup of water because I don't want it to be too watery. All right, this is Chef C's flavor. This is this is the grape soda with the fizz and it's gonna have body and it's gonna have flavor, people. Okay, you gotta stick around, it's gonna be very good. So what we're gonna do right now, we got our one cup of almonds. All right, we got our, we got our water, it's about three cups. Okay, now what I like to do, you know what they say, the grape soda with the fizz, baby. I like to do a little bit of vanilla extract. Okay. I like to do a pinch of cloves. Not too much. Cinnamon. Yeah, we like that cinnamon. Look, a little bit of nutmeg. Look, you can put as much stuff as it as you want. That's up to you. But I do what I want because this is my kitchen. Alright. Now, brown sugar. Sometimes you can hold the top. See mine, it locks. So you'll be alright. I still like to hold it. And then we're gonna blend for no more than one minute, okay? <laughs> Now this is homemade almond milk from scratch. And what you do with your sifter, just move it around just a little bit. Now for you ladies out there, oh, I, I, like, I like my skin to feel nice and smooth when, when my husband kiss me or my boyfriend. And you can take some of this and make a facial, a nice almond, almond facial. And your husband and your, your boyfriend was like, mmm, she's so almondy. 
Earth milk, okay, people. Okay. So we so we made our our nice almond milk, as you can see, people. So now, as you can see, this nice. It got body, basically. You know what? I'm done. This is too good. I can't do this no more. Why am I so skillful in the kitchen? You know why? It's because of this lady right here, my mother, out there, out there in Covington. If it wasn't for her to teach me how to cook, I wouldn't know nothing about cooking. She said, "Son." have sisters I want you to learn how to cook so no you don't have to depend on no woman to cook for you and she did just that so now thank you mother so now we have this delicious almond milk from scratch now when we come back we're going to put together our peanut punch it's going to taste so delicious so breathtaking I mean for, if it's hot outside and you drink some of this peanut punch, trust me, it's so refreshing, it's gonna be so good. Stay tuned, stay locked in, because definitely if you blink, you ain't gonna get a cup of this, this milk. It's not gonna happen, all right? So we'll be right back, and we're gonna put all this stuff together. Stay tuned, Chef C, from across the sea. You got it. Okay, people, we are back, and like I told you from the beginning, your boy Chef C, from way across the sea, made some homemade almond milk. Okay, nice flavor. The taste buds is gonna blow. So the almond milk is our base, but ultimately we are making here peanut punch. For you guys out there, yeah, the peanut punch. Y'all women know, y'all know. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna pour some milk. I don't like cow's milk. I make my own earth's milk. Okay, this is earth's milk. Dot com people. So earth's milk, aka almond milk. I'm gonna pour some in. About three cups. Alright. Take some in your peanut butter. Wow. That's one. That's two. Alright. Now what we're gonna do, we got some oatmeal. Because the oatmeal is gonna give it its body, baby. You know? It's like that grape soda with the fizz. Yeah, Chef C, you always talk about grape soda. Yeah, but I don't want to drink grape soda. I just like the analogy. You know, who wants to drink soda without the fizz? You know? So, you're going to do that. About one and a half. Four. There you go. Now, and me personally, I like to put bananas in it. You don't got to put bananas in yours. You know, when you make your own challenge, you do your own joke. But I'm putting bananas in mine. It adds a little flavor and body, baby. Look at my shoulders. Flavor and body. Okay? Got your nutmeg. Not too much. You don't want to overpower. Right. You could do it to your liking. If you like it, then do it. Close. I like to put a pinch. Okay? You can put however much you want to put in there. It's up to you. It's your prerogative, baby. You can do what you want to do. It's your prerogative. All right, we got cinnamon. All right. You ain't got to put too much, because we already got some in the base for the almond milk. Okay. And my favorite thing, people, is what? Mixing. I love to mix it. Because everything is having a party, baby. Oh, gotcha. Okay. No bloopers today. So we're going to mix this bad boy. This is the fun part, people. Look at that body, baby. You got that butter love, oh baby. 
you know, I ain't gonna sing too much because I don't wanna get taken off the, the air. You know, even though my favorite artist is Jaheem. Alright, all right, you gonna hear some Jaheem a little bit, you know what I'm saying? So now we are going to do the best thing that Chef C loves to do us. Taste testing. Mm. Oh my god. Once you get this mustache, that's when you know it's good. <laughs> I'm gonna leave the mustache on. Cause it's that damn good, okay? So people, like I said, we made homemade almond milk from scratch with some almonds from the store. You got your oatmeal, your cinnamon, your spices. And ultimately we made peanut punch, people. So now, we put it all together and it tastes great. <laughs> what more do you want? It's your boy Chef C from way across the sea. We're here in Tanzania and Dar es Salaam making something the Caribbean people will call peanut punch, okay? So stay around, like that subscribe button, notification, all that stuff that y'all know y'all gotta do to see me more. All right, we'll be right back for later on. We got, we got some more special stuff. Chef C, every time I cook, it's a show. So stay tuned, we'll be right back.